body. I have solid lump of existence, a vehicle to traverse the absurdities of this wrecking ball life, a limb wriggling awkward gas bipedal form. This is a body. This body is not bad. No matter how many times its ears are whispered otherwise, no matter how many times I walk into different gendered bathrooms at different hours as different anxieties push and tackle its heaving head and sickly stomach, no matter how many times it is perceived as over, underweight, mine, yours, theirs, hairy, hairless, pretty, prickly, or ugly, this, my body, is not that. Body. I know we have a complicated relationship. Your tactile tinglings against bed sheet or skin make me want to scream, HOLY FUCK I EXIST SO BEAUTIFULLY AND I EXIST SO HARD THAT IT MAKES ME WANT TO ORGASM! But some moments, some slices of Swiss cheese clock rounds, I want you to be beaten. I want to eat always or never again. I want my head hammered against high school. I want to take my pocket knife and rip these bulbs from my chest, two lips in the winter time. I want to prick myself deep and plant hair seeds for spring, for treasure trail blooms and dandelion things just beyond my armpits. Sometimes I would like to forget that I am my body. My mind sometimes feels like an unguarded 10th grade chem class. My body is my mind. My skin sometimes feels like it'd be better made out of glass. My body is my skin. My face sometimes feels just wrong. My body is me. The body. You are not female. Your skin is not a watercolor paint by number for bruises. Your nose would not look better broken. You are not so full of shit your eyes are brown. Your shoulders are not the saddles for the parental devils of the too thin, too fat planes. Your sideburns are not attached to your face, but they are sideburns, goddammit. <laughs> Vulva and your intention to keep it do not speak for your identity. Your feet are not witches, do not burn them at the stake. Your knees may break or hurt, your back may ache, but body. My friend, despite all the gossiping religions, I know that if you're gone, I will end, and most often, I really, really don't want to do that. So, I will garden myself. Gently pull my mind weeds, plant my hair seeds, surgically and safely remove these tulip bulbs for eons of wintertime beardy lumberjack love. I will be a Tim Burton topiary, carved awkwardly by Edward Safety Scissorhands. I will change myself lovingly, press and grasp myself close to whatever light makes me live, hope others will hold me to them because being cradled by the world might help just a little with this shit we call self-love. And this body, my body, this tippy, lumpy, evolutionarily flawed form will go on being and being mine. 